Greetings, Shelby County Schools family. School builders may be closed, but the continuity of high quality education never ends. Shelby County Schools educators are still working for students and families who we deeply miss. Yes, things are different, far different than we could have ever imagined, but the resilience of the 901 community keeps us motivated. As we all continue to cope through this unprecedented pandemic, we recognize that many students and families are dealing with anxiety and a range of emotions. Moms, dads, grandparents, and guardians, you are now balancing remote work, unforeseen financial strains, and the added responsibility of homeschooling your children. It can all be overwhelming, but please understand that self-care is especially important during these uncertain times. Our Parent Welcome Center phone lines are open and homework hotline is available. And I'm excited to announce that this week we launched a social emotional learning support line. Help is here. And we want our employees, students, and families to know that we care. Now, here's Jericho Phillips with more on this week's updates. Following the governor's recommendation Wednesday, Superintendent Ray announced schools will remain closed and employees will continue working remotely the remainder of the 2019-2020 school year. Student learning is a top priority, so families are highly encouraged to continue using all instructional resources at home. As a reminder, comprehensive learning guides covering lessons and activities for the rest of the school year are available at scsk12.org slash instructional resources. Due to an overwhelming response, the district is in the process of printing additional comprehensive learning guides and workbooks, and a central location for distribution will be announced soon. The Tennessee State Board of Education passed several provisions allowing districts to develop strategies for students to improve quarter three grades. The district's plan will be presented with principals, teachers, and families next week with more details. This forthcoming plan for grade improvements will only impact quarter three. The new Discovery Education virtual learning platform is now live for all students and teachers with thousands of activities, videos, lessons, and resources for grades K through 12. Explore it all at scsk12.org slash discovery. In alignment with the district's focus on social emotional learning, we are offering new support for students and families during this difficult time, including a live counselor hotline and a 24 hour informational hotline. Learn more at scsk12.org slash SEL support. Our partners at Peer Power are offering free eight week ACT prep courses in advance of summer testing. Registration is now open through April 24th. Register at purepowerfoundation.org slash ACT dash prep slash schedule. We're expanding our outreach and support through the new Voice of SCS Plus with three new channels, Reading Radio, Kids Music, and Radio in Espanol. Plus, our programming can now be found on Amazon Fire TV, Roku, and as a downloadable podcast. And finally, as we know, the COVID-19 crisis has prompted districts everywhere to accelerate plans for blended and distance learning. We are actively exploring options for a plan that will provide students with a digital device. We are bringing these options to the board for input at the next academics performance meeting to help shape a robust district-wide plan. You can learn more about the digital options at scsk12.org slash newsroom. Thanks, Jerrica. As we follow stay-at-home orders and find creative ways to stay engaged during this quarantine, take this as an opportunity to commit to literacy. Students can become and remain strong readers even during a pandemic, so long as there are adults who will read to them and encourage them to read. Let's talk to our children, care for them, nurture them. While we could not have imagined a disruption to life of this magnitude, Shelby County Schools has always recognized the essential impact that education and our schools have on society. It is why at the start of 2020, during the State of the District Address, I commissioned everyone to join us in becoming Change Champions. 
change champions for such a time as this. Change champions who speak life and uplift the children of Shelby County. We may not know what tomorrow holds, but we do know that we will get through this. Coronavirus will not defeat us. I get joy when I think about the possibilities of Shelby County Schools. We are stronger together. We are 901.